still can't believe you went. What are you thinking? Going to that place. Wish you hadn't got yourself into this mess, but you did. And you can't run forever. I know you were just trying to do right by me, so I need you to do what's right by us now, please, Cass. I am so tired of fighting. I just want it to be over. I want you home. The girls want you home, but... If you don't deal with this, then we are done for good. I love you. But I won't wait forever. Sus. Jesus, Sus. Girls need you a Christmas card. <laughs> Fucking Christmas. Kaz, Roy's finishing up breakfast if you want something. I'll, I'll be there in a minute, Trots. Aye, well, didn't wait too long or someone will be up with you. Aye, yeah, all right. Hello, welcome to Steel Weeks, the deep creep week and very possibly Halloween. So this is a, a fairly recent horror game developed by the Chinese Room uh, who did Amnesia Machine for Pigs uh, and before that did Esther so I'm expecting a lot of emotional story gut punches basically uh, is that the letter I just put down yeah where's this Christmas card then and we sound extremely Scottish there we go uh, sorry girls I can't smell spell Christmas <laughs> oh, I intend to do a Scottish accent for long um, why accents tend to blend together into one anyway? Uh, sorry, Campbell, just busting into your room. Yep, so we're Kaz McCleary, evidently. Stronger together. Let's read your post. Yeah, quite right, Trots. To Cadol Management and Boards, in care of Mr. D. Renry, Consultation Manager, blah, 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 blah. Dear Sirs, North Sea Oil Workers Union, Aberdeen Branch, gives notice under the provisions of the Trade Union Labour Rating Plus of attention to take industrial action. Due to abject failure to meet with our representative to discuss genuine safety grievances from our members. Eee, the striking. Good on you. Okay, canteens and downstairs. He's on night shift, so. Assuming, uh, Probably sleep if we're in during the day. You in here, Henderson? Davy must have gone back on shore last night. There you go. Good morning. Good morning. I'm all right. What are you doing up there? Pipes leaking. If it's not one thing, it's the other. See this old rig? It's a pile of shite. It's falling apart. <laughs> and they've only just started drilling. Fucking Cadal. And fucking Rennick cutting corners. Aye. Speaking of. You are in the shite, wee man. Rennick got a letter this morning from the mainland and he's been up to high dough ever since. Heard he's gunning for you. Well, that's just brilliant. Christ, I need a smoke. Can't find my lighter anywhere. Take mine. I don't need it anymore, honestly. You're a fucking lifesaver. I'm going to get breakfast. All right. I'll see you for darts tonight. And we'll put a wee picture of Rennick up on the board for you. <laughs> plan. See you. Boil of shite. I love it. Watch. <laughs> Sadly, there's no towel slap button. Oh, the lighting's bugging out a bit. We're down to the canteen. Yeah, uh, here we go. I'm there. Canteen's down there. Best minute again to receive a hint. Oh, I'm good. All that lighting is. I'm in a bit of trouble there. Oh, Christmas! I mean Christmas. Of course, that's why they got a Christmas card, Josh. Cool, Roy. Casmel yeah, Mocker. I do. McClary! To my office. 
Fuck it. Fuck it, I was just about to get myself some breakfast. The sweet sound of Davy Rennick. You think it's the Paulus? Can't be surprised, Kaz. Have you heard from Suze? She's talking about divorce. Oh, I'm sorry, Kaz. She'll come around. Not if I get to jail, she won't. Well, maybe you could have considered that while you were battering Billy Chamberlain's head in. Cunt slagged off Suze. He had it coming. And there he is. Floats like a butterfly, stings like a bee, and swears like the devil himself. Listen, mate. Even if it is the police, maybe it's best to just go back and face it. Yeah? Ach, I don't know, Roy. I'm fucking scun up with the whole thing. The Lord loves you, mate, no matter what. And I'm pretty sure Suze does too. That's all clear for you now, Roy. Lovely job, thanks, Dobby. Oh, Trot says he's left your insulin in your cabin. Oh, bless his little communist socks. <laughs> Muchly appreciated. Ta. Remember, life is like football. It's not over until the final whistle. Aye. You're a Barnsley fan, so you're pretty much fucked from the off, right? Oh, I will see you hang for that McCleary. Off you trot, lad, before his nibs blows a gasket. Made it down to the canteen. We survived the walk to the canteen. Brody and Raffs. How's you doing, boys? No bad, Kaz. Raffs here's a bit shaky, though. Gonna be the lad's first solo dive this morning. Is that right? Ah, you'll be alright, pal. Especially with the big man here looking out for you. Have you done it before? Christ, no. I'll stick to the lecky, thanks. No great in tight spaces, and it's blowing a gale out there. Really helpful. Glad with confidence there, Kaz. Ah, sorry, wee man. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Brody's got you. I don't know who this guy's head, who, whose head we caved in, because this guy seems to right other than uh, the occasional head caving. I dare. Your last day, McCleary. What's that supposed to mean? You've been a naughty boy, from what I've heard. Ah, give peace. You're not exactly an angel yourself, I dare. I'll be fine. Well, you'll not be missed. You wouldn't know a day's graft if it slapped you in the face. <laughs> I'd like to see you try and do my job. You wouldn't know a spark plug from a fucking hairdryer. <laughs> <laughs> Watch your mouth, McCleary. You're threatening me. Yeah, I lied about not doing the accent. Uh, all of these rolls. <laughs> I guess we got to park ourselves on the empty chair. Trots, O'Connor, and Gibbo. There's no escaping. There's going to be a dozen mayor rigs up here by the end of next year because the pricks in Westminster want their grubby wee hands on Scotland's oh, oil. Christ, none this again. The bear is already down to the bare bones. And Cadal are just going to make more cuts to get other rigs on the go. If we don't take industrial action soon, this place... Oh, come on! If we don't take industrial action soon, this place will be even more of a death trap than it already is. He's got a point, though, Gibble. We're down to a skeleton crew in the pontoons, and it's ropey as fuck down there. Workers of the world unite! What do you think, Kaz? <sighs> I don't know. Just here it affects the lecky. <laughs> What do you think will be keeping the lights on if this place falls apart? That's coal, you numpty. <laughs> <laughs> oh, unionized. Nope. Okay. I'm guessing this was back in day. So, uh, unions have gone through uh, some harsh times. Christmas Day menu. Roast turkey with haggis. Neeps and tatties. Very good. Brussels sprouts, carrots, pigs and blankets, black pud, gravy, bread sauce, all other do love a bit of bread sauce. Uh, Christmas pud with brandy sauce and cranachan, cranberries, something. And Perkins. Oh, poor Perkins. Draped over the Christmas pud. Uh, I guess we're going through administration. Head outside onto deck. Alright. Oh, yep, yeah. gotta get me out and me uh, gloves. Safety first. Oh, yeah. That's a proper rig. Right, better head up and see what the score is. Surprised the police would bother coming all the way out here. Yeah? Am I all right to get by, pal? It's all right. You have to go around, Kaz. All right. 
could probably have told that just from uh, looking at it. Ooh, it doesn't like being outdoors, does it? Frame rate's going a bit nuts. Don't worry, it'll be me who's getting the kicking. Guess there's too much weather effects out here for the old PC to handle. Don't just run around in the circle. What was that different ladder? <laughs> Everything looks the damn same. some uh, some help I'm um, there so I just gotta like cross across this little bit I'm guessing which is helpfully full of these thingies need a hand there fellas a clearing no I can scale find a skid by myself <laughs> <laughs> no we're all right cheers though fair enough you want to transfer here McCleary you give me less lip Oh, he loves it. Clear it. My office. I don't make me ask again. In a better mood today, is he? You'll be all right, Kaz. You get used to it. We all get a turn. Try not to punch him. <laughs> no promises. <laughs> I'm enjoying Scottish oil rig simulator so far. Okay, I guess I'm not supposed to be in here. Yeah. <laughs> okay, guess I'm going the other way around. Blake's going to be shouting at me all morning as I try and find my way. I guess I just follow this little green thing and hope it leads us to the right place. Ooh, Roper. Wait, Jacob's laddering me. Trolls acting up this morning. Got the crew running around like blue ass flies. But they cannot make head or tail of it. Is that you behind schedule then? Oh, not yet. And not if the gods are smiling on us. So mere fuck than ever. Poor as fucked as you by the sounds of it. Look, you better get up there. The boss man sounds raging. <laughs> well, how long will that take? Water's in, but might be two, three weeks before it's shipped. Like, I can patch it, but we'll need to keep an eye. Maybe say a prayer and all. Seems like what to do knows. Stay on the path, mate. A cargo hoist will crush you if you get close. I'll bear that in mind if there's any monsters I need to crush. <laughs> Jesus, Scooby. Give me a heart attack. Oh, sorry, mate. <laughs> we favor. What do you need, Scoop? Oh, could you do me a quick fix on the crew lift fuse box while you're down there? I need bother. Oh, you're a lifesaver, mate. And don't let the big man get you down, all right? Thanks, pal. Hey, I talked to everyone. <laughs> Yeah, pluck you out. And that's a quick fix and a half, yeah. But we don't need the other one. If it gets the lift moving, I guess. Why have you not in my office? On my damn way. That's the true horror of this game. The Fucking boss not getting off my ass. Installation manager. I'm assuming that's the prick. There, I'm in your office. Happy now? Here they fucking go. Enter! <laughs> 
You know he's a prick because he says enter and not come in. So glad you could join me and sorry to have got you out of bed. Shut the door and have a seat. No, I'm fine, Stan. The set your ass in that chair, you fucking liability. <laughs> I run a tight ship. Do you understand me? A tight ship. Technically, it's not a ship. Shut your gub, you Ned prick! <laughs> I'm sick, sick to fucking book on the UE gob sites messing with my operation. That chef might be a mate of yours, but he does not run things around here. I do. Do you understand me? All right, why don't you just get on with it? Don't you answer me back! You might be the height of shite on shore, McClary, but out here, I am the fucking king. Do you understand me? You bring the polis to my door, to my rig. Uh, look, I, I can sort this, right? I just need time. Shut it, you clatty gobshite. I've got here's a man who can make a more positive contribution to this operation than you. Look, I know Shut you. it! I'm in a meeting. What? Fuck's sake, Gibbo, I don't care. We're on a schedule. It's a fucking drill. You've got a fucking drill, so drill through it. Yeah, well, Roper's a whiny old fuck. He's got a problem with everything. I don't care if it feels half. Just fucking do it! Or I'll come down there myself! Is that uh, trouble with the missus? <laughs> you hear me? Fire. Come on, man. It's only a wee bit of trouble with the polish. I'm good with the lecky. I keep things running. You said it yourself. Out! Get off my rig! Aye. Happy New Year to you too, you cunt. There we go. <laughs> I knew in a Scottish game the start to cunt ratio would be quite low. <laughs> Board the helicopter. <laughs> well, no more running for you guys. <laughs> Fuck the safety instructions. Ooh. Jesus, Gregor! Gregor! There goes Gregor. Fuck. Oh, and there goes Kaz. That would be death. <laughs> Water ain't as malleable as you uh, want it to be. Christ, but you're a right pair. Two bars and a ball bag. Now listen, <laughs> I promise I'll take care of him. I had a word with our Kieran, you remember him? He knows Billy Chamberlain from way back. Owes me a favour. Reckons you can sweeten Billy up a bit. Come on. Have I ever let you down? Roy, you lost the cake at the wedding. N now then, now then. That, that wasn't my fault. You left it on a bench at Argyle Street. Aye, you were that bloated you didn't even remember baking the cunt. Oh, my children, that was before the light of the Lord came to me. Here we fucking go. Uh, and you, Mr. McCleary, you can fuss and cuss all you like. But perhaps if you went to the Saracens a little less and the Tabernacle a little more, then perhaps you'd not be in this pickle, eh? Don't, don't look at me. You're the one who decided to spend the next four months trapped on our egg with this bampot. Susan, I promise you, I promise you, we will get this straightened out. I will. You'd better. Guys! Oh, okay, I'm still alive. <laughs> Not surprised. What about Gregor? Did you get him? Can you hear me? Is he gonna die, Brody? All better now. <laughs> I 
I'm not sure you'd be able to get to your feet quite as quickly as that, but... Well, I don't know how long it's been, I suppose. We've survived the event. Uh, right, well... Let's see what state the rig's in now. I need your help here! What the fuck? What's going on? McLeary! Thank Christ! You are right being up on your feet? My heat's killing me, but... Aye, aye, I think so. You got me out. Did you get Gregor? I got you, aye. I couldn't find Gregor. Fuck. I'm sorry, Kaz. Oh, Jesus. He's not the only one we lost. Oh, no, no! Rass is still in there! Why aren't these working? Kaz! I need you to help me! Kaz! What? Right, aye, what, what do you need? The cable's stuck. Go down and release the main brake, then come back up and raise the bell. Oh, he's... Is that the youngin in the diving bell? I think I can get him out. Aye. He didn't sound too good. Raffs, it's alright, we're getting you out. We'll be two minutes, pal. That's the break. That's it! Come back and winch up the bell now! Well, that don't sound like it's just rafts in there, mate. What's going on, Brody? What happened? Don't know. The drill hit something. An air pocket or gas explosion, nobody knows. But whatever it was, it was big. Hell yeah, it was. Trust me. Douglas is trying to find out Mayor. Like if the bear is even safe now. What's wrong with rafts? I don't know, alright. Decompression shouldn't be this bad. Oh, I shouldn't have let him go down there. I said I'd look after him. I'm here, rafts. It's pro day. I'm gonna get you out. Uh, is there anything Mayor I can do? No, I'll get him. We need to know what's going on up top. You'll need to go through engineering. The way up is blocked from here. Where's engineering for here? I've never been doing this end before. The only way you'll get there is to go under the rig. Should be a clearer path down there. All right, I'll head down now. No, oh, down sounds bad. And uh, that raft doesn't sound too good either. <laughs> I, yeah, I have the sneaking feeling we're not going to be seeing much of Brody anymore. As uh, somebody tells me, Raffs ain't quite alone in there. You know, got something in his mind, clawing away at the edges. Entering under rig. Okay. Okay, I'm here. Oh, Christ. Uh, Lake C has access to engineering. Can I actually go this way? No, okay. Stuck fast. Go a good long way around. I see the, uh, the yellow paint. I can't complain because I could have turned it off. But uh, I figure as I'm doing a video, I should probably know where I'm going. Oh, this ain't good. Yeah. Jumping is weirdly floaty. Down we go, I guess. Oh, oh, rather you than me, Kaz. That's death down there. Cold death. Fuck. Right, one leg C, I think. We're on this way. Whoa. What the fuck is that? Okay, we've hit some weird seagrass that's making our brains melt. Just another day on the rig. Let me pop that off. Ah, oh, you're shitting me. Oh. oh boy. 
At least he's a sensible man and crawled over it. Rather than doing the old balance beam trick. Because fuck that. <laughs> That the trill was left of it anyway. Fucking weird, man. There we go. Now we're not gonna burn our face off. Ladder down. And up we go. Balance beams. Although, you can, this way you can at least go sideways along it here. Shit! Fucking see again. Okay, we're not going in there, which means I think we get a run and jump to a ladder. Ooh. That would be a fucking oh, oh god no. <laughs> I needed to get the other hand in. That'll be a wrist breaker of a catch, I think. Shite! You didn't know how right you were, mate. Try that again. Ooh. Okay, gotta keep the right hand on. <laughs> now we know. I let go of right trigger last time thinking left trigger would like supplant it, but no, it was just uh, both hands were needed. Oh, fucking hell. Monkey bars, can't do these. I'm working on my upper body strength, but it's definitely not to this level yet. I used to be a runner, so all my muscles in my legs it just makes it difficult to lift myself up. When you got the skinny arms. Well, I was a runner than a hiker, so. <laughs> it was all leg all the time. Oh man, okay. We got some weird ass fronds going on there. In we go. Engineering. Entering leg C. What is that? So, weird seaweed stuff. I've been clogged by seaweed. Well, this brick. Temporary. Jesus Christ. Monkey bars. Oh yeah, that looks like a drill issue to me. <laughs> There's certainly an issue. Don't know about the drill bit. Oh. Seems safe. Okay, I thought we were going across that. Ah, oh, no, it's up here, I think. Is it? Aha, temporary ladder. Can we shear me in across now? Yep. We're tomb raidering our way around here. Alright. So we're there in leg C. Assuming we need to get to engineering ops. Or well, at least just get through here. Get a better idea what the hell's going on. Something useful. Oh, I wonder when we were getting a torch. Battery pack, maybe? Haha, <laughs> there's a proper miners cat style torch, that's good. How do we turn this sucker on? Why? Okay, well unless the game may have jump scared me then. <laughs> 
Use handrail. Yes, that seems appropriate. Oof. It's not what you want to see in an oil rig. <laughs> the water should be outside the oil rig. <laughs> Good question. So we're going through there. Not going to make me unscrew it, then, are you? Oh, we've got to pull it there. Yep, there we go. Gosh, it's like alien in here. <laughs> Blood. Jesus. So we can throw objects to distract monsters. Guys, over here. Jesus, Finley. You all right? Tell me what you've seen a ghost. Who's making that noise? Gibble. He's making that racket. Should we no find him? Help him? No. Then I recommend that. What does that mean? It means he's no alright. After that explosion, he got oil or some shite on him and just... I don't know. He freaked out. Went for me. Okay. Out there. You mean out here? As in out here with me? Aye. That's exactly what I mean. Oh, that's just fucking brilliant. You seen anyone else? I just got here. Where are you going anyway? Back to accommodation. Listen. You'll have to get through the water tanks to get up to accommodation. And quiet like. Gotta go all the way up there. Jesus. And what about Gibble? Stay the fuck away from him. You're listening to me. It's no right, cuz. I'm not arguing. Cuz. Be fucking careful, eh? Aye. You know. Okay. Let's turn this off, shall we? Gibbo, <laughs> down here somewhere. Probably ought not to alert him. Though I imagine it's going to be a case of running. Oof. Okay, let's get away from that, shall we? Ah, ah. Is there a ladder there that I miss? No, okay. <laughs> Gibbo. Buddy. Ah. Okay, steam off, I think. So much steam. And oh, now it's like too quiet. <laughs> Where do I go now? I, maybe there was a way back up this ladder that was 
Covered in the steam. Ah, yes, yeah, this way. All right. This looks like a fun door. Oh boy. That uh, was a, a fun noise. Gibbo. Oh, this is this, this, this Gibbo summoning can. the water tanks. Well, back to the water tanks, I guess. No, don't go with this. The fuck is that? Use the lockers to hide. I don't see any lockers. Just, I don't like this. I have no idea where I'm going or doing or... Buddy. Oof. I don't like this tool. <laughs> you can probably tell by my Lack of seeing anything. Hopefully, Gibbo can't climb ladders. <laughs> Stay away. Oh, boy. did, but he doesn't sound happy about it. No. Douglas. Oh, sorry, Douglas. Douglas. Oh, Jesus. No. He can't be. Oh, yeah, he didn't look good. Oh. Sorry, mate. Just got you out. What are you there? when they apologise to you. If you're gonna kill me, kill me. Don't apologise to me about it. Lifeboat, that sounds good. No way through. No lifeboat for us.
Okay, well, I need a moment. <laughs> that was actually genuinely quite unnerving. Um, yeah, breathe in, breathe out, repeat. Yeah, that was very tense. I need to get warm. Jesus. Heaters. Okay. Fuck. Stop thinking about it. Just stop thinking about it. Jesus. Jesus. Right. This little tiny heater wouldn't do much, to be fair. Right. Okay, I think you're warmed up sufficiently now. <laughs> Fucking gibbo, dude. I don't even know. I don't know if he was actually chasing me in that segment or what. Yeah. Hello? If there's anybody here, fucking say something! The phone there. Uh, laundry. Oh, I can give those having another go at someone there. No. Locked. Should probably follow the phone, eh? It's probably the big boss man coming to tell me that I'm a prick for not dying to Gibbo. There's a call of you at line eight. Clearly here. Cass, it's O'Connor. I've got Bruce and Fergus with me. Do you know what's going on? No, but we had something. You need to get out of there. Don't need to tell me twice. Listen, something's wrong in engineering. It's not safe. It's a gibbo. We'll go through the leg and come up through the under rig. Rennick better give the evacuation. O'Connor, you have to go through accommodation. It's all blocked. Do you hear me? Yeah, don't go through engineering. There's a big gibbo shaped problem in engineering. Home sweet home. No, yeah, we're in accommodation. I got quite away from the other side, to be fair. I'm going to book. Christ, that stuff is rank. Yeah, the fuck? It's all wrapped around gibbo, I'm guessing. That's why he's gone nuts. It's like grown all over him. We'll shut the gibbo door. <laughs> Anything to say about the Christmas tree? No. Crew lounge and canteen. Fucking hell, that's the yeah. Oh god, you can get a good look at it. It's all like fleshy and pulsy and meh. Roy! No, 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 he's not here, fuck. I have to go around the crew lounge and try the galley. Please, please be there, mate. Oh, Roy was our good Christian buddy who's uh, turned into the chef. Trot. Trot. Is that you in there? Okay, Trots has gone. No unionization for us. We didn't exactly try very hard to get through the door. Not to, not to blame you, but you could have, like, put your shoulder into it or something. Well, emergency broadcast channel, I'm guessing. I knew it was going to be a gut punch. All these people are, like, really well written and cool and they're all going to die. <laughs> and not in a nice way, evidently. You know, wrapped around with flesh tendrils is, is probably not fun. What's that around there? Is there anything to look at? Is this mushrooms? Is that an actual game that people play? Is this the way to go? I don't know the way back there. I assumed this was just a bit of the Trot's death story rather than anything major. Nope, this is the way to go. It's 
sorry, wee man. That's the most southern way I've ever said anything in my entire life. Okay, we're on the other side of this little thing. Sort of half expected someone to come charging through that, you know. Hello? Roy? Buddy? Say something. Something other than <laughs> with me good. My dad's safe. How about you? Definitely not safe. Roy? <laughs> uh, see, I'm recording this on a Tuesday. Anchovy toast and eggs. Yes. Deviled ham casserole. Mm. Jellied haddock. No, we're out. That's too... Uh, I don't... Like this. Roy? Bloody hellfire! Get in, quick. Thank God you're all right. Jesus, what are you doing in here? What do you think I'm doing in here? What the bloody hell is going on? I don't know. People are dying, Roy. Dead? Who? who who's, who's dead? How? Douglas. Trotz, I think. I, I don't know. It's, it's this thing. I, I think it's doing something to people. I don't know what to believe. You know what I mean? I do. I really do. I saw something out on the deck. I, I didn't stay to look. It just scared the shit out of me. I should barricade the door. We can't hide, Roy. We have to get off this rig right the fuck now. Well, without running, say so. Right, you <laughs> what, you think we're getting evacuated? Temporary drill issue, motherfucker. We're at the bottom of the North fucking Sea. <sighs> right. The lifeboats, then? Aye. You stay. Barricade the door. Let me clear a path, and once we're ready to go, I'll come and get you, right? I'll be here, don't worry. Getting some extra prayers in. <laughs> uh, we're going to need them. Gaz, um... You, you won't leave me. Uh, it's bloody terrifying out there. Not a fucking chance. Not leaving you, pal. I wouldn't blame you if you did, mate. I mean, you've got all the food in here for a start. <laughs> Listen. Get your man upstairs on the case. And I'll see you soon, right? Chat with him a bit more. Evidently not. <laughs> it's like the writing in this game. I want to see if there's more of it, you know. Just uh, not because I don't want to get into the horrible monster he chases. <laughs> oh, it's a barricade, just like the. Okay, you just haven't barricaded. Okay. <laughs> I was gonna say I thought you were gonna like lock up the doors or something, but I assume Okay then, I'm assuming uh, we're out on deck to deal with whatever he saw out there we oh, yeah, don't get too close Is it just a look at or get close to? I know Amnesia was a look at, Sage Get downstairs to the lifeboat I'm starting, you want me to squeeze past that? You're fucking insane Stairs behind the kitchen will take you to lifeboat. Oh god. It's that fucking face. Jesus. What the fuck's happened to them? Did that eye just blink? It's moving. No, I think it just wriggled and I thought it blunked to. Yeah. Beginning to think, uh, oh, get by it. Better. Look oh, at Jesus. Sage Christ. Oh, my heat. Oh, fucking hell. What is that? Oh, fuck. Maybe I can go through the laundry. Yeah, wash some of the shit off me. I think we got ourselves another gibbo sitch. <laughs> oh, 
How do I look behind me? That's how I look behind me, okay. Hello? Anybody in here? Keep it down, mate. Here is the shipping forecast for the next 24 hours. <laughs> Viking southwest in the very west of the storm. Okay, this is good to know. I thought it might be. <laughs> He's got well, the shipping forecast. Oh, shit. Whoa, what the fuck was that? <laughs> Gone, whatever it is. <laughs> I'm not getting through there. I can't get this one open. No chance. Oh, like I'd want it. Oh, we're out on deck. Yes, we are. Christ. Where am I going to get down there? <laughs> I assume there are stairs here. Alright, it's time for some platforming, I think. Oh yeah, that looks safe. That's not gonna Shit. Oh boy. Probably be help more impactful. Like if I can remember who was who. Sorry, mate. Can't remember who was Boyd. <laughs> okay. Oh fuck! Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Of course, you're still alive. Oh, no, I don't think we'll be dropping down there. Oh, rather you than me, mate. Oh, that, yeah. On. Yeah, no. I know why they dangle them like this, but it always always goes wrong in in games when there's an emergency. You know, they always snap and fall. It should be like on, and you like crane them out, not leave them dangling. No, no, no! <laughs> oh boy, that's a dislocated shoulder. Jesus Christ! Let's not do that again. Right, not as though you can go back, mate. I don't know how you're going to go and get Roy. Alright, there's your lifeboat access. This isn't going to open. Yeah, it was because someone didn't read the sign. It says, do not obstruct. <laughs> These flesh tentacles have no respect for this. Well, oh, well. Ah, oh, come on, you're joking me. Oh, he's got life vests. <laughs> uh, is there anything that can be done? Okay, now we just gotta look for another one. Now that one's in better shape. Oh, thank Christ. It is. Alright, what do we gotta do? Uh, Looks easy enough. Remove safety pins from both arm cradles. Engage brake lever to swing boat into boarding position. 
and then fucking get on and go. Alright. Pin number one. Halfway out of here. One more. One more. And Jing Chong Shing. Right. Now the lever. Get it into position. Nearly out of this. Okie dokie. And boom. No! <laughs> yeah, you, you know, sort of saw that one coming. Perfect. No fucking one. Home by Christmas was the name of that achievement. You fucking sassy ass game. Oh, we got life jackets. <laughs> Anyone want to get me on the telephone? Locked. Yeah, we go. Someone wants to get me on the telephone. Line three. Who's that? Renick. It's me, Kaz. McLaren, what the fuck are you doing to my life force? It's gone. It's just fell off into the fucking sea. You must have done it wrong. Fuck off, Rennick. You built this fucking thing, not me. Who's with you? Uh, Roy's in the canteen. Finley and Brody are alive. Listen to me, McLaren. Get your ass up to the chopper pad. Bring anyone else you can find too. And whatever you do, don't touch this stuff all over the bearer. I can't, I can't get back out. There's a safety door, the railings are all gone. For God's sake, do I have to tell you how to do everything? Give the door a tidy kick at the bottom. It'll open right enough. What about you? Just concentrate on getting to the pad. Don't worry about me. See, Renick? What? Well, does this mean we're okay, like? No hard feelings? Get to fuck, McClary. I'm back. <laughs> fuck off again. I'd be happy to see you drown, but I'm not having your death on my fucking record. <laughs> Go on your cell, yo. <laughs> Can't stop being Scottish for one minute, can you, Kaz? Get old kick at the bottom, eh? Fucking shit, bastard. <laughs> hey, that's not good. Fire an alloy rig. Not usually good, is it? Oh, that's handy. <laughs> Aim and spray at the base of the fire. I'm guessing that's the source of ignition, so it's probably not gonna. Oh, it's gonna get in there. There we go. Everything's perfectly safe again. Oh, hello again. There's a caller on line one. Innes. It's Kaz, Innes. What's going on? I, I need help. I, I don't know what to do. Again. What was that? Look, something's happening to me. Oh, no. Innes, what is it? Innes! 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 Sorry, yes, uh, I don't think it's uh, going particularly well for you. Uh, not going well for me either, so uh, they call me back, eh? Alright, let's uh, exit to accommodation, have a quick peep at the horror that awaits us, and then we'll end it there. Okay, we're in utility. Get movable barriers with the right trigger and yank them to the side, okay? Someone barricading themselves. Hmm, flesh piles. Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> I need to go around somehow. Yeah, this is going to be another monster chasey bit, I think, because it's got all the hidey sections in. I heard tippy taps then. 
there like a don't think I'm getting under there anytime soon oh anyway uh, I'm sure there is an obvious thing that uh, I'm missing, but I'm out of time anyway, so let's just look at this ooze for a second and leave it here. So this will still wakes the deep. Um, kind of interesting. Uh, yeah, it reminds me a lot of Soma, actually. I think it's more the setting than anything else, and like the amalgamations of people and shit like that. Um, but I kind of dig it. Uh, so if you want me to continue this, maybe I can do it on streams so if you really want me to be scared, because I hate shit like this. Um, but anyway, thank you very much for watching. I uh, hope you have enjoyed Creep Week. I think there should be one more uh, tomorrow and then it's over. Um, so enjoy that and I shall see you soon. Goodbye.